Right, we've now graduated our, our, our drencher. We know we've got the right drench and we're going to drench it. It's important that we put the drench inside the mouth over the top of the tongue, um, but not too far and squeeze it gently. The point of putting it over the top of the tongue is to make sure that the product goes in to the rumen and not into the abomasum. In other words, it goes where it can be broken down and utilized by the sheep. The other point is very important is that we don't jam the um, gun in. If you jam the gun in, you're allowed to put it through the back of the throat and your ewe will die in three or four days with infection. Um, and the other area is that it's important to squeeze fairly gently. If you just crack it in, you can then still bruise the back of the mouth. You can see from the race that we have different size, different breeds here. We've got Massums and we've got a Herdwick. Clearly the Massums are heavier and bigger than the Herdwick and therefore we would be weighing the biggest of the Massums and the heaviest and dose the Massums to that rate and the Herdwicks, as we know, we've got her at 41 kilos, we dose her for the 41 to 50 dose rate. So it is important if you have diff two breeds or you have variation in the size of your sheep that you pick out the heaviest and dose to the heaviest. There are of course different guns. The one you've seen is, is the old traditional one. This is a newer gun which is coming from New Zealand. It's easier to use. Uh, it's um, got a nice short nozzle so you're unliable to put it through the back of the animal's throat. It's also got the, the correct angle on it to get it on top of the tongue and it's very easy because you put it over the top of the animal, animal's mouth and press and it's much easier 